Hello and welcome to Mike's Garage. Um, first thing I need to say, of course, is if you haven't subscribed, please do. And when you do, by all means, please click on the little notification bell and you'll be notified whenever we have another video up on the channel. Okay, got that out of the way. Alrighty, in our last video, what we did is we moved out we moved over the wheel. We actually shifted the, the, the adjustment of the spokes to move the rim over slightly on the hub to get it centered. I've got it about done. I've got to true it up perfectly before I go any further, put the tire back on it before I can put it on to the front end. But in our last video, I also showed this brake shackle. And this here brake shackle, one end was different. This thing was offset. It was thin on this side and wide on this side and it didn't fit for our application. So I took it over to uh, Turner's Customs and I said, I want you to weld this. How do you want me to do it? And they said, well, just cut it off, put it back on, tack it, bring it over and I'll finish welding. it." So I put it on, I cut it off and I put the two pieces on. I mounted them on the bike and then camera Mike man came Mike cameraman Mike came and and uh, tacked them in place. Then I took them over yesterday and got it all welded and cleaned it up a little bit. So here's what it looks like. I'm putting it back on now. Of course, I can show it real quick. See the welds, and this is the one that shows. So it's the one that I cleaned up. To me, there's nothing ugly about a nice weld. Now, we've got this thing, it really doesn't belong here, so we're going to carefully clear this fork leg and get it over here to put it in place. And, and this is the shackle bolt that goes here. As you can see, it went in really nice. And we can put the lock tab on it. <laughs> the lock tab on it and the nut on it. This is not a final installation yet. And get that on there and get these washers on here. Get this nut on here and of course after it's uh, cleaned up and painted then I will put the Zerk fitting back in there. But here is the complete shackle installed. And let's see if Mike can get a nice shot at it. I ground off the top so that it wasn't ugly. And this will all be painted. You won't really notice it in there anyway. I just wanted a nice, neat piece. Um, in our next, next video, unless there's something more demanding, I'm going to show how I paint this kind of a part and make it a real durable paint job. So I'll be taking this off and getting it ready to paint. I wanted to mention, however, because a lot of people have mentioned to us, a lot of people have thought it was ridiculous that we didn't throw a nice wrench, that we didn't... Uh, have Bluetooth, have a wireless microphone. And so cameraman Mike went out and he actually bought us wireless microphones. And that's what I have on today. And there's no cord. And here I am appearing live in front of you, cordless. And if this really works out, we'll do it next time. So until then, see you out on the road.